In just over 30 years, Rosemount Estate has established itself as one of Australia's leading wineries. Most of the fruit used for its celebrated red wines is grown in McLaren Vale, just an hour's drive south of Adelaide. Rosemount's commitment to quality has led to the creation of wines renowned for their full flavoured, easy drinking style. This unique combination is the magic of Rosemount and has been lauded around the world by wine lovers, critics and judges alike. Although the winery was founded in 1969 from an Upper Hunter Valley base, it has grown beyond that. It now has vineyards in Mudgee and Orange in New South Wales and in South Australia, Coonawarra, Adelaide Hills, Langhorne Creek and McLaren Vale. So tell us, how long has wine been made in McLaren Vale? Wine's been made in McLaren Vale from around 1850. It was one of the earliest plantings was at a place called Hope Farm, which is around this area, and that was set up by George Pitchers Manning. And he established the vineyard in 1850. He also had his first vintage in about 1855. And his current his winery that he built is now our current Rosemount Cellar door, which is nice. To, the um, the winery site, which is you know, some distance from here, was originally established by Frederick Wilkinson in the in the 1880s. And again, that vineyard that vineyard and wineries had a lot of history, and it's a, it's again an area that's been growing ever since 1855. I understand that Rosemount has some of the oldest vines in McLaren Vale. Yes, we certainly have access to some of the oldest vines. These wines here form part of our Balmoral Shiraz and they're an old vineyard. It's a, they're incredible things, old vines. They seem to know the season before it even happens. They seem to regulate themselves and produce really concentrated fruit characters. And we see that on these vines. They produce a lovely, rich, deep, full-flavoured wine which goes principally into our flagship Balmoral. We have also old vines which we use for our Grenache based wines for the GSM, but they're an old Grenache vine rather than an old Shiraz. As a winemaker, is it important to keep one foot in the old world? Yeah, that's an interesting question. I, I think it is, yes. You need to you need to understand where you've come from so you know where you're going to. So I'd say yes, you do have to keep one foot in the old world. I think you have to keep your, your head in the present and your eyes looking at the future because there's so much changing in our industry and certainly by having an understanding of the old techniques and using them as we do at Rycroft with our open vat fermentation and other techniques, it's an understanding of what's there and um, looking forward to what happens in the future. You need to keep challenging the old techniques and the modern techniques. Yeah, I'm sure you need a, a good balance right across. Yeah. Rosemount Estates McLaren Vale operations offer an insight into the winemaker's success. They have taken traditional winemaking and blended it with modern Australian techniques to make full flavoured fruit driven wines, which are finding favour with wine drinkers across the globe. <laughs>